Hey, what's up everyone? Glock9 here and welcome back to Lockdown 2. It is the morning of day 7. I've got a couple of skill points to spend here this morning and I want to get a point into Grease Monkey because we really need a vehicle. I'd like to skip the bicycle and go right for the mini bike if we can make that happen. And then at some point we'll pick up one of those forgetting elixirs and respec all of our skill points. Uh, anyway, this morning we are going to head in this direction. There's a passing gas over behind Moe's. Uh, let's start there and then we'll push further into the city. Here we are. And what the hell is that? Oh, is that a branch? Looked like a giant insect for a second. Right, I'm, I'm okay. I'm fine, really. Uh, we got an ATM here. Let's start with that. Oh, I don't have any lockpicks. That's okay. I'll beat into it. 918 dollars. Oh, that door's locked. You guys gonna work on that door? Okay. You guys work on that door. I'll, I'll go around. Oh, it's a beautiful morning, isn't it? Except for that giant robot over there with a the big gun that wants to murder me. Ah, uh, there's a back door here, fellas. Down he goes. Check this out. I updated the mod, and now we get Cobalt from the Juggernauts. We also get Lead and Brass, but now you get Lead and Brass from regular robots as well. And then from Max, we get the Cobalt, but we also get Refined Cobalt. So that's cool. You might notice my uh, tool belt is also a little larger with this update. I'm not sure what else has changed. I just saw that there was an update and I updated it because we might as well be playing the most up-to-date version, right? Okay, might as well take him apart, get a little brass and lead. And then still we get the springs, mechanical parts, and electrical parts. And now a lot of people were telling me we're going to need a lot of electrical parts. And I don't mind spoilers like that. That's not really a spoiler. That's more of like, I wish I knew that before I started type of shit. You know, I don't want to get further down the line and go, fuck, we should have been collecting electrical parts the whole time. I'm not going to go crazy, but I will, you know, take apart appliances and stuff when it's convenient. That thing, eh, it's walking away. All right, I'm going to take the car apart. A eh, vehicle book would have been better. Anything else up there? Nope. Uh, there might be something up here, though, because there is a ladder. Give me that ladder. Get, come on. Get up there. Here we go. What the fuck? Welcome to the I Can't Climb the Ladder show. Nothing? Well, a backpack. Corn. Yay. Anything in there? No? No? Uh, let's just get the main stash and get out of here. Brass. Man, what? Why aren't there any workstation books and destroyed workbenches? It's kind of upsetting. You get a lot of electrical parts from them, though. So, uh, worth taking apart for sure. Alright. A little bit more gas. Let's get down here now. I don't think I've been down here yet since Alpha 21. I don't think much has been updated. Wakey time. Oh, that's stuck in him. Yeah, look. <laughs> He's got an arrow sticking out of his head. That's new. I, I mean, maybe it's new. But every arrow I've ever shot at these things has broken. Now it looks like we can retrieve arrows from them, so... That's good. Fireman's book. Uh, reduce the chance to be lit on fire. Okay, if you say so, book. All right, now what? Oh, there's another one of those Judy Witch POIs. There's one right by the prison as well. Oh, what's that? Is that a cracker book? That's what it looks like. Oh, fuck yeah, that's where we're going. Eh, uh, should probably avoid that guy. 
And why can't I find any anti-rad pills? There's mechs everywhere. Uh, let's just run into the store. Hopefully we can read enough uh, medical books in here to unlock the anti-rad pill recipe, and then we won't have to worry about finding them in loot anymore. Come here, shithead. Electrical crafting. Hey there. Oh, shit. Fucking Chad. Here you go. Oh, shit. Damn it. Guns work better when you put bullets in them. Ba da ba ba ba. You're a fucking idiot. My mom always said make songs about stuff and you'll remember it better, so maybe that'll help. Will you just die, you big black and yellow bitch? No, oh, he's hanging on by a thread. Where'd he go? There he is. Yeah, now I'm gonna wrench you and use your parts to make stuff. I'm gonna make a robot toilet and shit on it. Plenty of sledgehammer books, but that's a given because we got Skull Crusher maxed out. Level 2 Claw Hammer. We'll make one of those once uh, I get my hands on a fire axe. And then with the fire axe and the hammer, we can ditch the stone axe. Oh, there goes his arm. Is that new with the update also? Robot dismemberment? Or no, I was knocking their heads off prior to the update. I don't ever remember seeing an arm or a leg come off though, so maybe that part's new. Whatever, let's eat some cornbread. Anti-rad pill? A medical book. Oh, anti-rad pill recipe. That's even better. Now we can craft them ourselves. Looks like we can do it at a chem station. And it'll cost us one chrysanthemum, one goldenrod, one nitrate powder, and one bottle of water. Super cheap. Or we can craft at a campfire, and it basically doubles that. Still just one bottle of water, though. Still super cheap. Chrysanthemum and Goldenrod. Uh, we might have to leave the wasteland, though, to find that shit. But the forest biome is not too far away. Mining book. A uh, chance to mine rare gems. We already read that. Another sledgehammer book. Plastic parts. Hey, buddy. Alright, let's get on the roof. This, uh, oh, this is gonna drop us down. I always get this crack -a book confused with the other crack -a book The other one, the main loot and everything is on the rooftop. This one, you gotta drop back down into another room which has the loot and probably some more robots. Yeah, I'm taking apart your buddy. What are you gonna do about it? Nothing. You know why? Because I'm gonna kill you and then take you apart also. And then I'm gonna use the parts to make Inspector Gadget arms. Let's go, you fucks. Oh, everybody's like super sleepy down here. Still sleepy? Alright, well, I'll take care of you one at a time. It's fine. I thought that was gonna one-shot him. I guess not. Uh, let's get over here. Read these books. Rifle book. Get the fuck out of here, big boy. These are books, not tasty cakes. Even though you're, you're a robot, you wouldn't want... Want tasty cakes? What do robots want, other than world domination? There we go. Let's take them apart. Making some good use out of our wrench today. Got a drone over there and a supply drop coming in. That is to the south. 
Might have to go grab that. Should probably mark that on the map, right? Because last time it uh, disappeared. Assault rifle book, stock schematic, and knife guide book. Let's just uh, throw a marker right there. We can use uh, that. Just called drop. Okay. Uh, let's take care of the drone. Yeah, that was stupid. Awesome. Yes. But stupid. Also, yes. Can you fuck off? Yeah, let him work. We'll get into this crack a book crate here. Oh, what the fuck is that? A Ramba? Holy shit! It shoots at you! Oh, it's a flying drone. It's on the floor. It looks like a Ramba. Or Roomba. Is that it? That's probably it. That makes more sense. Roomba, because it vacuums rooms. I don't know, because I would never buy one, because that's the dumbest shit ever. I can vacuum the rug. You know who buys a Roomba? That one aunt you have that only shops on QVC. And that's why she bought the Roomba, because she never gets off the fucking couch. Wasteland Treasures Book. Harvest more lead and brass from sinks and plumbing. Okay. Uh, the plan was, after this place, to stop home and then do the Judy Witch POI. The one that's next door to the prison. But, I think we should go grab this supply drop first. Oh, shit. Why is that happening? Uh, run away. What the fuck? There's just certain areas of the wasteland that are completely radiated. Let's not step on that. Um, shit. All right, we're going to go do this POI here. It's uh, just about hour 15. This thing is like a tier four, I think. So the wasteland, it's like a six skull POI. I mean, we just drank a coffee, so we should be fine. Hey, there's some goldenrod. Look at this. Goldenrod and chrysanthemum? This is exactly what we need. Well, that's fucking sweet. Dude, we can craft some anti-rad pills tonight. Don't even have to go to the forest. Uh, yeah, tier 4 POI with the two wasteland skulls. So, uh, six skull POI. We'll be fine. We'll get through it. Nothing in the well. Hey, some pumpkins. Don't mind if I do. That is a crazy amount of chrysanthemum and goldenrod. And there's another JW POI not far from here where we can get more of that shit. Well, I mean, we are going to go back to the forest eventually anyway to see uh, Robot Jen again. There's got to be a trader in this town also. This is a big enough city where there's got to be a closer trader than Robot Jen. So uh, hopefully we can find one. You know, it would make finding a trader a lot easier. Vehicle. Well, this certainly looks like the place to start. Oh, mama. Look at these big boys. Alright, come on now. Oh, you sneaky bitch. Oh, shit. Ow. What the fuck is shooting me? That thing, really? All the way over there? Come on. Give me your parts. Oh, will you fuck off? Ow. All right. Screw it. Ugh. The drones are the worst. For sure. Um, I mean, well, I guess the mechs are pretty bad. But I haven't been shot at by a mech yet. I think they can shoot. I mean, a lot of them are walking around with guns. I guess they're just not as aggressive as the drones are. Nothing under there. We're going through here. Oh, shit. 
Yeah, where are the workstation books? It sounds like someone's coming. No? I'm gonna take this thing apart. Oh. Eh, maybe it was this one I heard. Nice! Fucking Battletoad. Thought I was done with the basement. Hello, little friend. That's two anti-rad pills we have on hand now. How much does the toaster sell for? One dollar? Fuck that thing. Ah, trap book, bow book, wiring, and sledgehammer books. We can make a uh, primitive bow, level three iron sledge, level three fusion sledge. I looked into that before. Um, I don't know what the stats are compared to the iron. I imagine it's better. Uh, level three. Uh, it does cost some forged iron, which we can make because we have a forge. And electrical parts and some other shit that I know we have, so... Um, I don't know if there's a way I can tell if the level three fusion is better than the level six iron, but I'll look into it tonight. Oh, yeah, give me those robot bits. Oh. What's that? What the fuck? Oh, that's a drone. It was trying to shoot me through the ceiling, I think. Which is bullshit. It's not the mod, either. I think it's just the nature of Alpha 21 right now, because cops can see you through walls, too. They're not supposed to puke at you until they see you. And, uh, apparently cops can see you through walls. At least through one layer of wood walls they can, because... When I made my all-wood-based, cops were puking at me right through the fucking walls. And and here the drones are shoot trying to shoot me uh, through the walls, too. I guess we gotta make this jump. Is that fucking drone still out here? Alright, we gotta go this way. Uh, oh, see ya. There was nothing but trash up there anyway, fuck it. Oh, well, we're going down again into the ground. Now things are getting interesting. I mean, they, they were pretty interesting. As soon as we walked in and there was a whole bunch of mushrooms growing. What the fuck is going on here? Well, that's locked. Okay, we're going up then. Robots. We at... Oh, there's one right there, laying on the floor. Mining book we already read and uh, salvage tool crafting. I think I already have a wire tool. Wake up, buddy. Oh, shit. Eh, fuck it, I'm going. Ow! Where's that drone? Ow! Uh, okay, we'll hide behind the truck. Where'd you go? Up above. Come on out. What are those other two doing? They're stuck down there? I guess so. Come here, shithead. Well, party's not over yet. Well, it is for Chad. And that one. No. Fuck. Let's go up. And we should probably use a first aid kit. Get out of here. Now the other one fell. Nice. Okay. You stay down there. What the fuck is that? Plasma spear. Why am I finding plasma spears? I maxed out Skull Crusher. Where's my plasma? Sledgehammer. I don't know if plasma is the best. Laser might be the best. There's fusion, plasma, laser. I don't know what the stats are, though. More mushrooms. Oh. I think that's all from in here, yeah. I don't think they're coming from up the stairs. There's quite a few in here, though, so we are gonna end up going back up the stairs. 
That one's dead. Let's get the fuck out of here. It is past my bedtime. Luckily, home is right over there. But so is a giant mech robot, so let's avoid alerting that thing. Okay, not a bad day. Man, I wish we can find the local trader. Then we can just knock out tier one jobs and get a bicycle as a um, reward. Let's not use everything. Let's just craft uh, two of these for now. Uh, oh, shit. We need a beaker to craft those. And we don't have one. I think Robot Gen has one. I'm pretty sure I saw a beaker there. Well, shit. I guess we're going to have to take a trip back to Jen's place. Anyway... Uh, my plan for tomorrow was to uh, head back out looting. I wasn't going to go back and see Jen either until day 9 or possibly even after the horde again. I really wanted to try and find a trader in our town, but with, uh, without being able to craft more anti-rad pills, I think we should probably take a trip to Jen's and get that beaker. I'm almost positive she has one. I could go back and check the uh, the last episode when we were there, just to make sure. Uh, but I also want to try and go south to that supply drop and take an anti-rad pill and see if that allows us to go into that crazy radiation zone. Because if it doesn't, then that means we need some sort of equipment to do that. Whether it's a hazmat suit or, or a mod, I'm not sure. I guess we'll eventually find out. Anyway, guys, that's it for this episode. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Hope you're looking forward to the next one. Thank you so much for watching and all of the support. You guys are the best. You can follow me on Instagram or Twitter if you want. It's at Glock9Gamer. I follow all gamers back. Stick around for more Lockdown 2, and I will catch you guys in the next episode. Oh, shit. I guess I can't fill up jars from toilets anymore. Damn it. That was so convenient. At least we got a water source right outside. So it's a little less convenient. But it's what we got to do. Do this quickly. Well, at least we're not drinking toilet water anymore. So cheers to that.